year. Didn't know that he was going to be thrust into this position, not only as the quarterback for USC, but with a coach on the hot seat as well. On first down and 10. He just, he, he just fits the role. And I, I think even when JT comes back next year, Slovis is going to probably wind up winning this job. Hey, what a battle that will be. What an offseason it will be here. Here's Michael Pittman. His first for seven. Tyler Vaughn's Amon Ross St. Brown, Drake London throwing the ball. Pressure and slow over you. This isn't the Matador in Spain. No, okay. no, it's not. Thanks for pointing that out. <laughs> Slovis underneath. That's Drake hey, London. Hey. You have give yourself a chance to convert. That's the maturity of a young quarterback through the course of the year. With a young center as well, the redshirt freshman Justin Dietich. Covered in chalkboard paint, allowing students to write slogans on it. This rivalry is serious, serious business. Here's St. Brown on the pitch. Turns the corner, has the first down, and running through heavy Los Angeles. He can play either position, receiver or back in the backfield. Here's Slovis in a nice pocket, steps up and fires, and completes to Tyler Vaughns. And some yards after the national championship in 1954. I always remember your record in rivalry games. Right. Oh, uh, Mr. 3-0, and oh, I got you. Slovis, the throw. There's a senior, not fooled on that one. From the UCLA 23, it's Carr on the ground. Hey, hey, hey. He's just short. Going to get nine with Carr. Trojans going quick here with Carr, and he is not back. Almond Ross St. Brown is back deep. St. Brown running up, and he muffs the punt. Muffs it at the 35. And UCLA has jumped on it. First down and 10. Out at the 37, five receivers in there for Slovis. Which one does he want? Juggled momentarily by Drake London. Work and mechanics throwing the football. On the ground, first down yardage. Levi Malapai, his first carry. And I would have to relay it to my play, my playmakers, and they wouldn't know what was going on, and <laughs> said it was a mess. Now it's a lot easier with Harold. Slovis, deep shot's got a man wide open, it's caught. It's Drake London. But much better than that. On the ground, on first and goal from the one. No signal for the touchdown yet. There it is, the late signal for the touchdown. Gone, and he started crying. That, that, it hurt him that much. He attacks everything that way. Here's Keenan Kristen. Michael Pittman, throughout the rest of his career here at USC, he would catch 500 balls a day in the offseason. Here's Slovis going to take off and slide down. Uh, following in his footsteps as a physical player. Here's Slovis to throw. Across the middle, it is caught. It's St. Brown. Really uh, a pleasure to play football with him. Hey, Michael Pittman can do anything he wants to do. He could be successful at anything and, and will be. Slovis complete. The ball comes out. Going to rule that an incompletion on the field. Has won that award. All the great wide receivers they have here. Well, Marquise Lee, right? Yeah, 2012. Slovis the throw and there is Pittman dad liked this this catch watch this ball is thrown high and inside way off target But look at Michael Pittman and there's another one coming by the way the freshman wide receiver Micah who plays at Oregon It's St. Brown Michael was having none of it. He went straight to the locker room See if they get that rematch in the Pac-12 championship game. Yeah, I'll see you at Thanksgiving <laughs> <laughs> Steve cards before the game no, I did not read that one. Just read the card, Levy. <laughs> that should be the bio on my Twitter page. <laughs> Here's Slovis. Good time. Throws. It's Drake London. But, yeah. Probably a lot of runner-ups. Yeah. Here's Pittman. Lowers the shoulder down by the pylon. The call, I thought it was a terrible call. <laughs> Ran 64 to the house. USC finished the season number one. And was voted national champion. Between the tackles for USC, they've got to get a little bit of run game going and take some pressure off of Slovis. USC could hope for. Now the pay eyes missed the previous five games. Now Slovis to throw and complete. It's Pittman. Back him up and Fink's been unbelievable in that spot. Saving the season on a couple of occasions. Complete, it's St. Brown. Good gain and then a seam route to St. Brown. Fifth possession. They've gotten points on the previous three. Slovis underneath. Flag comes in. 
It's Pittman. First and 25 after the penalty. Slovis throwing high. That's no problem for Pittman. This is their passing game and their receivers. You should make them have to run the ball, but there's a lot of single safety in the first half. Second and 16. Shot for the end zone. Bounces around and falls incomplete. There are flags. First down and goal from the five. Slovis is dropped back at the 15-yard line. Second down and goal now. It's Pittman underneath. He's down, guys. Third and goal. Slovis throws it is caught, and Pittman will sit down in the end zone for the touchdown. Touchdown. Watch this. This is really poor defense from UCLA. You got two guys. Here's Drake London. He could have gone there, or he could have gone to Pittman. Either one was wide open for the touch. Dull slate of SEC games. Let's put it that way. Rather, <laughs> the Saturday. It was close enough. Here's Pittman. But on the field, Keaton Slovis has taken control of this team. There's no question about it. Slovis carried that weight the same way that he is right now. He's going to be a special player. Always got a smile on his face, especially after that. Lee's the punt. And St. Brown looks to return it down the sideline. Here, three quarterbacks. He's got, as we mentioned, nine players on the defense uh, that He's are fresh. Unbelievable job based on all the things we just talked about. I saw it the same way. And there's no question they need to make a decision quick, whatever it is. Question. Slovitz the screen to Kristen. The true freshman. Able was, you know, what this kid has, he's figured it out. He's mature beyond his years, and nothing seems to rattle him. There's Michael Pittman. Great is throw it quick, get the ball out of your hand, and then try to slam it inside. Hey, 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 Kristen hey, hey, again. Hey, we're done, we're done. Got the one yard again in midfield now. Cromenhoek, the tight end in motion. Slovis to throw. And complete. Just about perfect. Fires. Man all alone. Drake London. And four passing touchdowns three times this season. It is remarkable. And he's throwing again. That's batted down. And what he has done here. As he will throw it again. They have totally abandoned the running game. Now, all that being said, and he's had an unbelievable game, I don't know what UCLA is doing defensively because they're just playing man-to-man -man coverage the entire game. And they're not expecting the run from Stephen Carr. He's created equal. There's a different kind of air raid for Mike Leach is running. Some pressure. Slovis stayed on his feet. Arnold. Yeah, Darnold. Sam Darnold, sorry. And Sam Darnold, that's the difference. He's more mobile, but you do see the pocket presence in the field. And for those who love the star prospects, it's completed. I'm not going to chase all these camps and all these uh, things that they're requiring quarterbacks to do. I'm just going to play my game. And it worked out for him. Completion. And I think Michael Pittman's had a better year uh, than, than Jerry Judy. And he had 18 more catches coming into the game, too. Yeah. Throwing again. It's Drake London. Foot in the turf. Number 15 here in, in Drake London. And we asked Michael Pittman about him. And he said he's a, he's a freak. You know, he's 6'5". 200 in the future at the receiver position, no question. Slovis doesn't feel the backside pressure, takes a big shot to the head. F Scary hit, and good for Keaton Slovis that it's not something serious. High snap, welcomes Matt Fink to the game. He transferred to Illinois, but he stuck it out and had a huge win against Utah when he was called upon. Remember from that game and what he said? I do. He said that we at halftime he was like, we were so close. We're in this game. <laughs> On the ground, Stephen Carr making people miss and now trying to run away from people. He is got him a headache, huh? Got to still be feeling the effects of that shot. Quick pitch. Stephen Carr starting to take things over here. That's going to go as a loss. Coming back against Mike Leach. See if he can do it against Graham Harrell. Pressure is picked up nicely. Slovis.
from the 27 of UCLA. Here's Slovis on third and eight. And it's dropped. Flat out drop by Amon Ross St. Brown. This for yes. just one win over Iowa State. Saw that little tweet exchange you had with Charles Woodson. <laughs> it's, it's supposed to be. Yep. We'll give him a lot of credit, too. I mean, on that last drive, they needed his mobility. They yep. needed him to take off. What are we doing? Taylor Twelman in the house. 60 seconds left in the third. Underneath for St. Brown, making some people miss. He is dynamic. Found Drake London all alone in a seam. This is the final home game, final game of the regular season for USC. They look to play on. Slovis, deep shot. Tyler Vaughn got it around him. There is. He's isolated on the outside with Elijah Gates, and it's just a little bit of a head bob to the outside. Gates jumps all over it. It's a nice job by Keaton Slovis. Second half, he needs to regain it again. Got a good look inside his face mask, too. Cool, calm. There is no panic. That's Stephen Carr. He's in traffic, checking audible at the line of scrimmage, moving Stephen Carr over in complete control. UCLA only rushing three, buys him plan for St. Brown. That's that's the definition of calm. Quick out to Pittman. All you need is one. And making your reads and being accurate. On the ground, here's Stephen Carr. They got him down. Got Conference. You understand what he's talking about. Man to man across the board again. Slovis completes. It's Drake London. He'll make some people miss. Quick throw. Deep defense from UCLA. Only rushing three. Checks it down to Stephen Carr, has first down yardage. And Keaton Slovis over 500 yards passing for 5.09 to go here in the fourth quarter. Slovis is still throwing, and Michael Pittman is still receiving. Utah has the best defense in the country. They're better than Georgia. Uh, they're better than Oregon. They, they, they are there's 38 and 27 yards. You want to talk about your explosives. Well, Utah has that. You already mentioned the defense. Mm -hmm. Conservative individual and, you know, snap gets away. Slovis able to We mentioned 12 of these Trojans will never play a home game again in the Coliseum. What's better?